We all have performed the speed test of our network. Well, if you have not yet, head on to speedtest.net and test out your network speed. I'm sure you will be getting amazing results. But when you are into actual downloading some stuff, you'll be disappointed by the speed of your network. For example, my network speed shows 6.4 Mbps of download speed. But when I'm into actually downloading a file, suppose an mp3 file, I'm getting nowhere around the promised speeds. My speed test results tell me that I should be getting download speeds of around 6.4 Mbps. But in practice, I'm getting somewhere around 0.7 Mbps. So why aren't I getting the promised speeds? You might also be having the same issue. We all have paid quite a lot of money for the high speed internet which at least look good on papers. Welcome back guys. You're watching TechBot and today I'll be clearing out all the confusions about the internet speeds. Your internet service providers have kept their words of the internet speeds. You should notice that the speeds that your ISP promises are generally mentioned in megabits per second. And the download speeds which you are getting on your system are in megabytes per second. And the value of one byte is exactly equal to eight bits. So if your ISP says that it will be giving you speeds of eight Mbps, then they are mentioning the speed in megabits per second. So the actual download speeds which you will be getting is one Mbps that is measured in megabytes per second, which we commonly use to measure the internet speeds. And that is exactly equal to eight megabits per second. To know the actual download speeds which you will be getting to download files over the internet, measuring in megabytes, what you have to do is just divide the internet speed as said by your ISP with eight and you will get the download speeds in megabytes per second. Suppose the network provider says that you will be getting 16 Mbps of speeds, just divide it with 8 and you will come to know that you are actually getting 2 megabytes per second of download speeds. This is the speed ah. test result of my network. The download speed shown here in 9.2 Mbps is actually in megabits per second. And if I divide it with 8, I am actually getting 1.4 megabytes per second of download speeds. The wireless networks like the mobile networks also have other factors which may affect the download speed like the weather condition of that area, the network coverage in your location or the network traffic in the particular area. One more point to notice guys, the speeds which are displayed on your Wi-Fi routers or the speeds which you can see in the LAN icon on the right hand bottom side of your system tray. For example like the 100 Mbps or 300 Mbps, these are just the port speeds. That is the speed which the ports are capable of handling and these are also mentioned in megabits per second. For example if your router says that it supports 300 Mbps of transfer speeds that means the port of the router can handle up to 37.5 megabytes per second of transfer speed. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope this video was helpful to you in clearing out all the confusions regarding the internet speeds. Also share it with your friends and help them clear out their confusions too. Also subscribe to my channel for awesome tech updates and also press the bell icon to get notified first whenever I upload a video.